And this bill is actually in the Senate for two years. If you don't, the consequences are very well, are very clear. You have to withdraw from the chamber. Honorable John Bandy. Make uh, a thank you, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, I would rather withdraw, but not the, from the chamber, but not withdraw. That this can please, please. The all, the, all, all the members, no all the members. There is no need for shouting in this place. Honorable John Bandy, is within, is within his right to refuse to withdraw. Yeah? And withdraw from the chamber. Yes? Honorable John Bandy. Honorable John Bandy. Honorable Wajala, you will also follow suit. I'm not, we are not in Budalang here. <laughs> there, are, there, there will be consequences which are well known to all of you. Read your standing orders number from 107 to 112. The Honorable John Bandy, having refused, failed, neglected to withdraw as directed by the chair, you are now ordered to withdraw from the chamber for the balance of this sitting, this morning sitting. Out. Honorable John, Bandy, Honorable John Bandy, when you are done to withdraw, it is not an occasion to go shaking hands. It is to withdraw. Out. Honorable members. Honorable members. Honourable members, I want to caution you. Any member claiming to rise on a point of order must state the standing order on which they are rising on, so that it, we, don't, we don't want a situation where members just want to, to make stand up and make statements. This is not the occasion. This is not the place. The place for that that kind of discussion is certainly not here. It's outside. We will, I will not allow people to just make statements claiming to be, point, to be rising on points of wonder. But any member genuinely desirous of rising on a point of wonder is, will be facilitated to do so. so honor members, honor members, honor members, I will again disallow a situation whereby no, Mr. Speaker, you have addressed it quite perfectly. That's what I wanted to, to raise. Very well. But I, can I see that the no, member Mr. for Sinoda. Very well. The <laughs> member for Lugari has an intervention. You will give him the mic. Thank you. Let me use the next. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, for the opportunity. I rise on point uh, of order and invoke standing order number 42 uh, regarding the procedural motion. Mr. Speaker, standing order number 42, subsection 2, states that if a message is received, is received from the President at a time when the House is not in session, the Speaker shall forthwith cause the message to be transmitted to every member and shall report the message to the House on the day